Hi, kids. Welcome to the Museum of Native American History. I'm Tiny Tusker, and this is a real medicine trunk from the late 1800s that you can see at the museum. But today, there's something special inside. Let's check it out. Hi, kids. My name is Evan, and today we're at the Museum of Native American History in Bentonville, Arkansas, and today we're going to learn about the medical uses of echinacea. Now, I love echinacea. I take it every morning in little gel capsules uh, with my morning supplements and vitamins. Um, I know it's good for me. So echinacea, or the purple coneflower plant, is a very common type of plant. It grows up to around uh, four feet, 20 inches, and you can see it growing around North America, specifically the Eastern United States, from Iowa and Ohio to Louisiana and Georgia. The purple coneflower has many uses, has been used for many centuries by the Native Americans as an herbal medicine for treatments of things like the common cold, coughs, bronchitis, and upper respiratory infections, just to name a few. The purple coneflower, or Missouri snake root, is a commonly used herbal remedy still used to this day, and has been found in studies to make mice about 50 to 80 percent more resistant to sickness, sicknesses like the flu. Plains Indians would use echinacea, or purple coneflower, as a largely medicinal plant. It was used for various injuries and illnesses from toothaches, coughs, colds, sore throats, and even snake bites. People of the Choctaw tribe use the purple cone flower as cough medicine and as medicine for stomach aches and pains. The echinacea or purple cone flower typically grows in rocky prairies and in open wooded areas, mostly in the Great Plains and in parts of the South, as well as Missouri and Michigan. Now, another use of the purple cone flower plant is its use as an anti-inflammatory along with value in internal medicine and dermatology, or doctors that work specifically with adults and working on people with skin problems. We've got echinacea. Thank you guys for tuning in. I'm Evan at the Museum of Native American History in Bentonville. Till next time. Yeah, 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 yeah.